Hello, hello, my friends. This is Chris from CoolPhotoshopVideos.com. In this video, I'm actually going to show you a cool trick that a lot of photography studios use. Have you ever wondered how they can take a picture that's in full color, single out one object in that color, and keep it in color while making everything else in the picture black and white or grayscale? What I'll do is I'll actually show you one way that you can do it and the tools that I'll be using today are the polygon lasso tool the zoom tool and the hand tool so let's get into it what I want to do is I want to take this orange keep it in orange and everything else be black and white so I'll just click one time on the zoom tool click again click again and I think we have it close enough and then I'll click on my lasso tool to go ahead and start making a selection. Now you can see that the orange is kind of cut off here. So what I'll do is I'll hold my space bar down to free up that tool so I can move the picture around. Once I let the space bar go, the lasso tool comes back. So I hold my space bar down, click my mouse down, and drag the picture over some. Okay. And I'll just scoot it up here just for training purposes. What I'll do is I'll just click on the edge and I'll just click on points around the circle. And as you can see, it's fitting right to the shape. Now that I'm at the top, I want to hold down space bar just a little bit and let it go just to move the picture down some. If you want to get more exact, you can always uh, zoom in a lot closer. But just for the sake of the tutorial, I'm just showing you the basics on how to do it. Okay, and using a polygon lasso tool, it'll give you a lot of freedom to get exactly around any shape. Now once you see that little circle by the polygon lasso tool, that means it's fully selected. Now that we have our picture fully selected, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go layer, new layer via copy. Now the shortcut for that on the PC is control J and the shortcut on the Mac is Command J. So what I'll do is I'll click that and now if you look over here in the layers palette I've singled out my orange. Now to black out everything else let me zoom out so you can actually see how the whole thing was gonna look. And I'm holding the alternate button on the keyboard. It's the option button on the Mac. Now that we have the whole picture I want to select the background layer so I click there and the shortcut to gray it out is control shift and U to desaturate it. Voila! So now we actually have a picture with an orange in it. So everything else is black and white or grayed out and now you have your orange. So if you want to find out more videos like that or step-by-step -step tutorials that will break down everything you need to know about being a confident user in Photoshop, make your way on over to CoolPhotoshopVideos.com. Thanks, and I hope you learned a lot. Take care. Bye-bye.